Okay, so Uber decides that it is going to start banning low-rated drivers. I mean passengers, excuse me. Because they can rate you just like you can rate them. And again, there we are with that social... Oh, what was it called? I did a reading on it. That social score. That thing. Social credit score. That's what it's called. And so you can be rated by Uber drivers. The Uber drivers will say, you know, whether you're a good passenger or not. <clears throat> I don't know what actually goes into that, whether you would just do docative or you didn't tip or were you just awful or what. Because where I live, the number one complaint is short rides because they don't make enough money. So you called me just to take you down the street? Yeah. I don't want to walk down the street, so I called an Uber. So either you're going to take me down the street or you're not. So that was like the number one complaint I hear is the distances that people have to drive when they do Uber. And then number two, where around where I live anyway, the number one complaint is people getting into their car wet because they mostly come from the beach which is down the street or they come they come from a pool at the hotel or whatever and they get into their ubers and then the seats are wet because they you know they've just been swimming so that's the second thing i got or complaint that i hear all the time so are they going to start doing that are they going to start banning low rated customers and what kind of effect will that have um, it's up in the air right now chaotic environment trying to juggle what's going on with the focus stop that so yeah indecision so they're trying to do something good for business and something good for customers and then they're also trying to do something good for the drivers to attract better ones and to track more than Lyft. And so what's happening now is you have an indecision, stalemate, and juggling all at the same time. So this is, this may have a, um, what's the word? Not preliminary, but it may have a trial basis. They may test run this in certain cities, you know, like they, um, I don't know if they can really do this in a Vegas market because that's kind of a bigger market than most, but they may trial run this. And Will of Fortune, time will tell. So yeah, when I get that, time will tell, that means they're going to try it. They are indeed going to try it. Temperance cooperation. Yeah, meeting in the middle. Seven of Pentacles, Harvest and Waiting, Patience, Patience from your idea, your initial idea or your initial investment in something. Around work, something you do every day, trying to improve, mastery. So they are going to take, they are going to test run this. Lovers, cooperation, five of cups, there's a regret, it does get some bad press in the beginning, five of swords, win at all costs, a dishonorment, and then a resistant to change, so this, this is going to be a battle. This is going to be a battle. This is going to be interesting is what this is going to be. Because like I said, in the beginning, you have the balance and the indecision. Like, okay, we have got to do something, but let's not be too hasty. And so they go for the trial run. Time will tell. So they go for the trial run. Cooperation, meeting in the middle. Everybody's on board so far. Not customers, because customers are not privy to that yet. But we're all, we're going so far. All right. We hit the on switch. Let's see what happens. Okay, everybody's at work. Everything's going on. Everything's going great. 
people are either aligned with this or they are not. This is an alignment. This is a regret. And so the press sets in. Uber banning drivers, Uber banning riders, and Uber. So this is this is this is a tale of or a battle of the spin, basically. How will this be spun in the news? Will it be like a you need to behave yourself to be picked up by us, or you cannot turn away customers with money? Mind you, any store, any business you go into, they have the right to refuse your service if you are obnoxious. So which is another reason I want to take a break from my regular nine to five because I'm tired of fighting with people. Hey, you need to get out because you this, this, and this, and this. But there is an embattlement when it all costs a dishonor, and then a resistance to change and clinging on to old ideas. So they're not giving up on that, not just initially. It would probably have to affect the bottom line a lot more than it does for them to give up on it. You know, and Lyft can say, oh, they ban you, we'll pick you up all you want to, but eventually their drivers are going to get tired of obnoxious people too. So, like I said, the press will get a hold of this, they'll spin it, and then we'll see what happens from there.